have your best for yeah. sure. Garrett Bateman, Ray Martin set to pull into the water box. That's Garrett Bateman right there in that A fuel dragster. Oh, good looking Smokey Bird in the right lane. That was awesome. Yeah, the supercharged car is taking an entirely different approach oh, to this. Hand out of the car. There we go. Yeah, take a look at Ray Martin there and just wave into the Unique crowd. style. He put his hand up. He said, I want to be Bob Bob. No, 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 not you up there yeah. in the top row. Two rows down, three to the left. Massive yeah. crowd here today. And Garrett Bateman with uh, that race car. We mentioned when we saw him earlier this season, he's got that 200-mile-an-hour club patch on it for making the great run out at Bonneville. We were down and visited him in uh, Redding, California a few weeks ago at Paul Ogden's house in Denton Hollowfield. A lot of the great folks that are just real hardcore hot riders at heart. A lot of them have raced drags. A lot of them have raced out of Bonneville. Bonneville also had a chance to meet uh, Garrett and his wife and son. The Hipling team here coming out with one of their best starting assignments in a while out of the two spot. Ran 530 at big speed in the opening round. You talk about drivers making some long hauls. How about Ray Martin coming all the way from Anchorage, Alaska? Ray Martin is just a very versatile driver in his own right. So you got a couple of guys in the starting line that have driven a wide variety of race cars and have had a great deal of success in both of them. So the second of the supercharged cars we're going to see here during this round is Ray Martin getting set to make his run. And Garrett Bateman, we always mention when the conditions start to warm up, the eight fuel cars, sometimes they can play havoc with them trying to keep all eight cylinders lit. Too, but give it to Ray Martin as the A fuel car and Garrett Bateman come up just a bit short, courtesy of a whole shot win. Check out the reaction times, figure out the difference there. And that's how you offset a quicker but losing elapsed time. 541 4, 265 the speed. I'm rounding off pretty impressive. Now, watch this at the end of the racetrack. It's going to be one hundredth of a second. Garrett Bateman's car, you see it just dropping a cylinder right there at the end of the racetrack. That might be the difference between winning and going home. Let's get down to John. And with Joey Severance moving on to the semifinals. And Joey, you got out and you said you're shaking more now than uh, you were during that run. Why is that? i just excited, I guess. We <laughs> won another one. The blower's still on the car. It's happy. Yeah, they have it, keeping the blower on, I mean, you know, that's game one, right? That's good for us, yeah, yeah. The, we're sneaking up on it. We did put a new blower on this weekend, and we're kind of sneaking up on the tune-up a little bit. But now we were hoping to run a little bit quicker, but hey, we got a W. That man? Taking on Ray Martin, that's one half of the semifinals. We'll figure out who else is going to race in a little bit. Bob, we got word down from the starting line. Ray was actually trying to find you and, yeah. and wave at you. Yeah, that's it. Bob, don't go, man, don't go. We're going to miss you. More Big O Tires NHRA Nationals when we come back to the Strip at Las Vegas Motor Speedway.